Anna Sokolow was born in Hartford, Connecticut on February 9, 1910 to Jewish immigrant parents, and at age two, her family moved to the Upper East Side of New York. Her very first dance classes were at the Emanuel Sisterhood under the instruction of Elsa Pohl, who was influenced by the work of Isadora Duncan. At age 15, despite her parents' judgment, Sokolow dropped out of school and left home to pursue her dance training at the neighborhood playhouse. There, she studied voice, dance, and mime, mainly by her teacher, Blanche Talmud. Talmud had a background in Delsart and Del Crow's Eurythmics. In the year 1930, Sokolow began dancing for Martha Graham's company. She became a soloist there and remained with the company for about eight years. While working for Graham, she often assisted Lewis Horse in his choreography classes. In 1933, she created the Theater Union Dance Group, which was renamed as the Dance Unit in 1935. The dancers in her troupe became known as the Sokolovas. In 1937, Anna Sokolow decided to add four men to her dance unit, which allowed movement to be presented on all bodies as equals, instead of being divided by gender. Common themes of her works were often communism, the growing troubles of the Jews in Germany and the Holocaust, workers' rights, and anti-racism. Some of her pieces from this time that reflect these themes are Anti-War Trilogy of 1933, Strange American Funeral of 1935, and Case Number Blank of 1937. In the year 1945, in wake of the Holocaust, she performed a piece called Kaddish, which is also the Hebrew prayer for mourning. Anna Sokolow did a lot of work in Mexico and was the second American modern dance company to tour outside of the U.S., with Denishon being the first. In 1939, she performed with her company, the Anna Sokolow Dance Group, at Bellas Artes in Mexico, in Mexico City. There, she started the dance group La Paloma Azul and created four works for them. It dissolved in 1940, but she still continued to visit Mexico City throughout her life. In 1946, she made a piece inspired by Mexican themes called Mexican Retablo. During the 1940s and 50s, Sokolow choreographed many pieces for Broadway, including Street Scene in 1947, Happy as Larry in 1950, and Ca Camino Real in 1953. Another popular piece she made in 1953 was Lyric Suite, which was a collection of solos, duets, and ensemble works set to music by Alan Burke. One of her most well-known pieces is titled Rooms, and it debuted in 1955 to the jazzy score composed by Kenyon Hopkins. It features eight dancers and eight chairs, each representing another character in a secluded room in New York, exploring the idea of loneliness, the idea of loneliness despite being in such a busy city. The movement is often repetitive and intense to try and show the inner turmoil. It became the first modern dance to appear on television. Anna Sokolow also taught at Juilliard for almost 40 years, beginning in the 50s, giving classes in method dancing. The Juilliard Dance Ensemble even performed a version of her piece Opus in 1963. In 1953, Jerome Robbins encouraged Sokolow to visit the Inbal Dance Theater, Israel's oldest modern dance company, to help them get off the ground, which became the first of many more visits. In 1962, she established Israel's Lyric Theater, but it disbanded in 1964. In 1972, she returned to choreograph pieces for the Botsheva Dance Company and Kibbutz Dance Company, which are still performed in the repertories today. Anna Sokolow was known to have a very strict and intense nature in rehearsals. Her works were made to reflect the reality of society, and her choreography covered a range of styles. Many of her works portray tension and disturbance, but others were funny and lyrical. Sokolow choreographed over 30 dances in her lifetime and worked in over 12 Broadway productions. She collaborated with musician Alex North for the majority of their careers, and they had a romantic relationship for seven of those years, yet she never had any children. When she passed in the year 2000, her group dance unit dispersed and became Players Project. Anna Sokolow has gone down in history as modern dance's rebellious spirit.